Bishop State. And welcome to your Tech Tuesday tip in two minutes with Robert Mac Williams. Today, we want to discuss how you can use Microsoft Paint to create training materials. Um, commands that we're going to be using for this exercise is the Windows key and R to get our run command up prompt. And we're going to be using Microsoft Paint and Microsoft word so let's just go ahead and open that run command and paint and Microsoft paint is open now let's just say we want to create a uh, screenshot of the AS400 if you remember we did print screen we we'll minimize that go to our item and paste and let's just say just want to item uh, come to this and crop I'm getting multiple screens because I have a multiple monitor set up here so once you have a screenshot and of course this could be of anything on your computer a website a document a diagram you can be creative uh, if you are creating this for your classroom or instructions what have you let's just say we wanted to create a diagram to highlight our pre-registered account so we can go to this box up here we can create any kind of shape or design um, I want it to be a red box so I'm gonna click red for our color I'm gonna get a square and uh, I'm gonna circle our pre-reg number and so in essence we create a box now of course depending on what you're trying to do you can pick any of these you could get um, let's just say we want to do uh, just say we want to do uh, we want to put an arrow just to, to, to emphasize that so of course you see we have create an arrow pointing to our number here and um, of course in essence um, I'm just using a bunch of uh, uh, shortcuts here we're going to do control a and then control C to select off control a control C to copy this and we're going to go ahead and open Word. And Word is opening now. Open up a blank document. And since we already copied that, we can control V to paste. And of course, our document is in here. And of course, this is a Word document. We could go in and type. Um, and of course, we could save this as a PDF, upload it to Canvas, or print it out as handouts, what have you. So, in essence, this is a quick way to create training materials using Microsoft word of course uh, as always you have any questions feel free to contact yours truly and as always thank you so much for watching this week's tech tip tuesday mm -hmm.